Welcome to another Nobel Review session for students of microeconomics. Today we're going to go over a monopolist that is taking an economic loss. When drawing your graph, start off with your axes. You have the price and you have the quantity. When I draw a monopoly, I like to start with the demand curve, downward sloping, label it D, and then draw the marginal revenue curve underneath. Your marginal cost curve is like a check mark, label it MC, and then your average total cost is going to be above your demand curve, but you want to make sure the minimum ATC hits the marginal cost curve before coming up to complete its U-shape. Figure out the cost-minimizing level of output. You find where MR is equal to MC, and label that Q, or Q sub M in this case. And then the price is on the demand curve. I labeled that PM. Very important that the price is less than the ATC. The per unit economic loss would be ATC minus the price. Don't forget to double check to make sure that all of your curves and points and axes are labeled. You can easily shade in the area of total economic loss by starting with the price, move on up to the ATC, and carry it on over to the vertical axis. Well, that's how you show a monopolist taking an economic loss. Thanks for studying with the Noble Review and watching our videos.